Okay, so um, a quick um, guide to using the Flowflex COVID-19 antigen home test. Got this for, um, you know, actually uh, because of the new variant, the Omicron variant, you know, uh, we're getting together today for the holiday party and, um, you know, everybody's a little concerned. Even though we have, some of us has our pad of booster shots and all of us have our two shots already, um, you know, because we have elderly parents, so, you know, we thought about getting a test. And um, I thought about making a quick video on showing people how to use this. So this is what we got from Rite Aid. This is what they're, you know, it's FDA approved. And this is a one test. So I guess uh, it's FDA approved for one test. So the Flowflex, basically, um, I did it for my wife already, so I have an idea of what to do. Um, unlike the other videos, the Flowflex they have in England, they have a holder. This one doesn't. So first thing you'll notice is you open up the box. We have instructions in English and instructions in Spanish. There's two instructions in English and Spanish. Uh, let's see the card. And you have a swab. You have the solution. And you have the actual testing kit. It's almost like a pregnancy tester in here. This is the Spanish. And it's very strange that this is made in China. And it's certified in China. But um, these are the only tests we could get. Basically, uh, we lucked out by getting it too. Uh, as soon as I, I asked about it, and then there was two of the per person that was, um, you know, you're going to get um, two per person and Rite Aid. And there was a line out the door when they found out there was, you know, this was available. So these three items, there is no holder like the videos that they showed you online. And most of the videos I see are from Europe. But this box itself is a holder. So what you do is, you see a perforated hole here in the middle, right here. And you make that tab and you close the box back. And that's your holder. Okay. You put this in. One thing the instruction don't tell you is to blow your nose. And I see a lot of videos they do that is because uh, blow your nose basically moisturizes around your nose. So you have mucus in your nose and that's what you want. So, close your nose, right? Open up this tab slightly. I opened it partially so it won't be contaminated. And you'll see that there is a solution at the bottom here, right? Okay. And you swab your nose. All right, let's get all this prepared. Partially open. You don't want to take the tester out until the last moment so it's not contaminated. This is the tester. This is the well where you're going to put the drops. Okay, so according to the instruction, you basically put this in your nostril and you swab it five times each. It goes in about, it says about a centimeter. Uh, oh no, sorry, one inch or 2.5 centimeters, right? So five times around each. Okay, four. Okay, one more. Okay, and then you, it goes into a thing. Oh wow, there is um, I can a solution at the end of this tip. That's why. It, Kind of um, <laughs> flaming hot. So you swirl around 20 times. Okay, and then they ask you to squeeze the tube around this. So I guess it's to get the solution around the swab, the con swab. Squeeze it five times, you swirl around to make sure basically everything's in there. Okay, and then swab back in here. Rip the rest off. You close the cap. In the videos they show you had there is a, a cap that they screw on. Okay. And then um if you want you shake it a little. Or it's like it, you can't really shake it because you know they say to shake it, but it's so so little solution you can't. So you flick it a little and then you take this test kit out. Four drops. There's a four drops into the well. One, two, three, four. And then you're supposed to read this result within 15 minutes to 30 minutes. They said do not read the result past 30 minutes. So your results should be within 15 to 30 minutes. So basically 15 
2.30, read the results. You can see that it's light, it's turning color. And basically you'll see these lines, almost like a pregnancy test. If there's two lines, whether it's faint or solid, you're positive. And then if it's one line, you're, it's negative. So I'm gonna pause this video and 15 minutes later I will, um... okay, you can see that it's one line and basically that tells you it's negative. If there's even a faint line at the T side or a solid line, then it's positive. So it looks like I'm negative. I'm good to go for the holiday party. Well, Merry Christmas, everybody, uh, from a crazy, crazy COVID year. Um, hope everybody's safe and um, have a wonderful holiday. Take care.